So this is the Brain Access Halo EG headband. It's a fully integrated uh, headband with electrodes, electron spirograph, and uh, power units all in a single device. It has four recording channels. Uh, uh, there is a common reference electrode in front, uh, then two electrodes at FP1 and FP2 positions, and uh, two electrodes uh, over the occipital region. Uh, these electrodes in the back uh, are spring-loaded, uh, so they are very soft, and because there are many of them, uh, they ensure very good uh, signal quality and comfort. So uh, let me show you how to correctly put it on. Uh, so firstly, position the reference electrode at the midpoint of the forehead, and then lower down the back part. Uh, once on, you can adjust the back electrode so they are uh, over the occipital region. You can move up and down or left and right. Uh, if the device is uh, too tight, uh, there is an adjustment mechanism on the left, so adjust it and then reapply again. Uh, so to turn, to turn it on, there is a power button on the left side box, so turn it on, uh, it will vibrate and then the blue LED will start breathing in as well. If the red LED blinks, that means it's low in power, so charge it first. So now let me show you how to connect to Brain Access uh, Halo device using Brain Access board software. So this is the uh, main window of the board. Uh, select Brain Access as a source. Uh, do you the scan? And after the scanning, we'll see all the available devices. So that's only uh, Brain Access Halo. Uh, select it. Press Connect. And after some time the um, Brain Access Halo uh, device tab will appear here uh, and contains some useful information. Uh, it contains the uh, stream name as well, uh, which you can find on the uh, lab streaming layer as well, and some other information like a sampling rate, channels, and the remaining battery level. If you press the graph button here, it will bring you straight to the Brain Access Viewer and you can check the signals uh, and check if everything's all right. Uh, so as mentioned previously, uh, the Halo has two electrodes in the front and two electrodes in the back. Uh, so uh, uh, let's check if the, it can detect uh, common artifacts. So if I blink a couple of times, we can see blinks here. If I move eyes to the left and right, uh, we can see uh, the signal on the frontal electrodes. If I uh, clench the teeth, it can be seen here. And if I close my eyes, we can see some alpha activity here. Uh, so once we check the signals, we can uh, go straight ahead and record data, uh, give a name here, and press start recording. Uh, and after you finish, you just press stop, and that's it. Thank you for watching. Uh, please visit brainaccess.ai for more information or contact us directly.